So, what do you kids need to tell us? I tried to guess, but my mind's a total blank. <laughs> Actually, Mrs. Pinciotti, Mr. Pinciotti, it's something I need to tell you. <laughs> Sorry, I almost threw up. <laughs> I'm fine now. You both know how much I respect your daughter, how much I love your daughter, and, uh, funny thing about love, haha, -ha, <laughs> is, uh, sometimes we express it in a, in a physical way. You better not say what I think you're gonna say. Because I'll be mad. And funny thing about mad, ha ha, is sometimes I express it in a physical way. I love your daughter, and I totally respect her, and I never stop respecting her, even when the cops came. Well, I'm sorry, Eric, but I still gotta twist your neck shut. Dad, you know, you shouldn't be threatening Eric. You should be, uh, thanking him. What? <laughs> wow. <laughs> He's treated me like a queen since the day we started dating. Eric and I have sex. There. You know. At least I have a nice boyfriend and not some juvenile delinquent. Like that Fonzie. <laughs> well, that... That's nice. And at least Eric had the guts to come over here and tell you man to man. Well, I'm happy for you. And thank you for being honest. That took a lot of courage, didn't it, Bob? I'm going to bed. <laughs> <clears throat> so, how was it? Oh, God.